Why the hell was I playing on hard? Well, aren't you a strong one, Mila Maxwell? I admit I'm rather impressed. I hope you'll go after the waymarker with a similar sense of fervor. Spare me your indignation. Don't you lecture me. Still have glasses on. Smoke, very original. Magician. You have my thanks. You're here from Spirius, right? The other one is gone. <gasps> dun dun dun. Now what? Now what? No way. It's really you. Uh, Mila! I searched everywhere for you. Sorry, Muse. I didn't mean to worry you. Any of you. Uh, I wasn't worried. We knew you'd be okay. It's good to see you again. I wasn't worried about you. There's another Mila, you know, and I'm worried about her. Mila, she's supposed to cook for me. She promised. <laughs> what happened here? Well, sacrifice. It's a brave thing she did. Madam Chancellor. Because of her and her selflessness, we can proceed with ratifying the peace accord. King Gaius, Prime Minister Rowan. For foiling this assassination attempt, you have my most sincere thanks. You'd have done the same. He's gonna get some action Even tonight, hey, Rowan. Perhaps you'd like to sign the treaty here and now. Harmony between Riza Maxia and Olympias would please me very much. Here on the ship? We've heard that many high-ranking Olympian officials stand against the treaty. Don't you worry. We'll employ this attack as our chance to press the offensive against them. No doubt many of them have ties to Exodus, and if we can't find proof, we'll make some up. Figuratively speaking, of course. Didn't hear what? I was just thinking aloud. But whatever you choose to do with that tidbit is up to you. You're certain, madam? I pay my debts in full, Prime Minister. And besides, if I were too much of a do-gooder, you wouldn't trust me. Oh. <laughs> Are we really that easy to read, madam? I so look forward to dancing the diplomacy two-step with you, your highness. By your signatures, the treaty is ratified. Very good. 
We've crossed the first bridge at least. It's funny because there's bridges there. The gap between this deed and the will of the people is not easily traversed. A difficult road still awaits us. Oh, you were two guys. Every journey starts with the first step. Well, that's a threadbare cliche. <laughs> <laughs> However, it does ring true at the moment. Yes, if we keep setting one foot before the other, we can reach the ends of the earth. You were a great help to me as well. It's not much, but consider this a small token of my thanks. Please be money. Please let it be money. Pay off my debt. Oh, just to be clear, this isn't a bribe. Pay off my debt, please. Pay off all of it. Mila, we have little time. You're right. Let's review the situation. Don't call her Mila! Every time I hear it, I want to barf! Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Quad mystic symbol. Rose Corsage. Cat's returned. And title Milo's good friend. Katie then. Let's shove this back on hard. Some of the XP and all that crap. I just take I just take it off of bosses, I guess. So what did I get? New items. Rose Corsage. Physical attack by 10%. Maxwell had style. Mila. Tropical thunderstorm. Four elements. Sapstraff amber. Maxwell haircut. Maxwell attire. Copper chunk. Lump of the purest copper. Mystic symbol. Enables fast, effective spell casting. What do I have on for accessories? Let's take off Rowan Specs. Rose Corsage. Oh, nice. Very classy. Uh, Shiba's Dog Muzzle. <laughs> Sidekick Mask. Tengu Mask. Hairpin. Rosy Cheeks Collar. Backpack. Bunnykins Mr. Frog. Loincloth. Pigtails Liz Beret. Rowan's Specs. L's Cap. L's Backpack. Rideau Shades. Mina's bangs, rose corsage. Might as well just have the glasses. The black ones look better. Got nothing. Mega lightning bolt. Ultimate fertile soil. Tropical thunderstorm. Oh, uh, where's El gone then? All the way to the other side. Should go stop off and see if there's any items as well. Buy some items along the way. Check the custom stuff. Anything new? Does not look like it. Buy. Did all my stuff get restored? Yes, it did. Just good. Where's she at? All the way on that side. By the boat. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. Everybody look at me. Awkward silence. Luger, why'd you do it? Hey, I didn't drop her. She let go of my hand. Fall back there? That's the only way to save you. Is what Mila wanted. So it's my fault. <laughs> 
No, it's not you. Oh, crap. Wrong decision. She wanted to keep you safe. How would you know, huh? I just do. She was her own person, but she was still Mila Maxwell. We did sacrifice her. I can't deny it. But, by my sword, I swear to you that the loss of your Mila was not for nothing. I'm just a kid. Get to the point already, would ya? Fair enough. I'll say it more simply then. L, I want to go with you to the land of Canaan. I want you to see what I do there. What do you sheaf it into? Eh, you just sheaf it into Sounds the air. Sounds like you mean business. You speak of Canaan. What's going on there? The soul purification has reached its limit. In the abyss, I saw it with my own eyes. There are too many fractured dimensions. Canaan is the only realm across all dimensions where the reincarnation process occurs. Thus, it stands to reason that the impurity which must be cleansed from all those countless dimensions must be flowing into Canaan. If we do not eradicate those dimensions, the soul purification process will break down. In other words, the fractured dimensions are not only dispersing soul energy, they're also concentrating this impurity. Wonderful. Sounds like either one is enough to destroy the world on its own. What happens if soul purification breaks down? The resulting poisonous miasma will probably overflow. And that means... Couldn't the Great Spirit Origin step in and stop that from happening? Only if he thinks humans are worth saving in the first place. I think that's the whole point of Origin's trial. So be it. We've no choice but to reach Canaan and pass the Great Spirit's trial for the sake of all humanity. The plot it is takes clear what wish we have to make to Origin. Destroy the fractured dimensions, so this one may live. Ah, uh, very awkward moment. We have detected that Maxwell is no longer blocking our passage. What kind of orders did Spirius give that Rideau maniac anyway? Did something happen with Director Rideau? <laughs> Just checking. That means we can hightail it to the dimension containing the last way marker, right? Correct. However, right now the dimensional abyss is highly unstable. It will be some time before you can enter the rift with any degree of safety. We'll contact you once we've made our preparations. Selfish bastards. I'm the reason. I unfortunately caused it when I harnessed mana out of the schism to take on a physical body. With the temporal crossroads gone, you merely did what you had to. It's taboo nonetheless. I'm using mana meant for preserving the world, to maintain my physical form. Hold on. I can only remain in the human realm for a finite amount of time. <laughs> hey, 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 Luger! It's Nova calling to gather up gold again! How's the cash stash? Is the dough rolling in? Are you having a gold rush? <laughs> I get paid by the pun, you know. Not the right moment. Oh, come on, not even a snicker. Wait, is something wrong? Uh. It's nothing, I have to pay back my loans either way, right? Uh, okay, if you say so. Boss man just wanted me to give you a little nudge. We have a bit of time. We should prepare for our final trip into the breach while we await Vera's call. Is that a sign for grinding? I miss you, Mila. Uh, that was very depressing. Chapter 11 end. Mila Maxwell. I knew that I'd see you again one day. 
I thought so too. And I'm pleased to see you looking as well as ever. It is life. We have to hurry to Canaan. The purification process is reaching its limit. Don't push yourself too hard, Mila. As if having to battle Kronos wasn't bad enough. You've spent a great deal of time trapped in the dimensional abyss. And do you think I'll listen when you tell me to take it easy? Ah, well, no, of course not. That is correct. This is no time to falter. And besides, you promised El. Not to mention the other me. Uh, how strong is Kronos? You know about the other Mila who was with us? I do. I saw everything. How could you? I thought you were trapped in the dimensional abyss. I was. I tried using the power of the four to return to the prime dimension, but couldn't. Because the other Mila had come to the prime dimension. The abyss between dimensions is a void of nothingness, bereft even of the elements. I could only drift through it using the power of the four to protect myself. While in that coma-like state, I dreamt of Luger, the other Mila, and all of you. It was as if I was journeying right along with you. How is that even possible? I do not know myself, but her conflict and her wish came through quite clearly. Luger, everyone, I want you to lend your strength to me. Or should I say, to Mila Maxwell. To both of them. You couldn't stop us from helping even if you tried. Our strength is yours to command. Kaden, make a payment on your debt. That's the next objective. Well, let's check if there's any new quests 